So this is a Huntington's disease pedigree. Here's the key. A black box represents an affected male. A black circle represents an affected female. A white box represents an unaffected male. And a white circle represents an unaffected female. So here in our first generation, if we have an affected male mating with an unaffected female, they end up having four offspring. They have an unaffected male, an affected female, an unaffected female, and an affected male. So this is the second generation. If this unaffected male mates with an unaffected female, they end up having four offspring, and they're all going to be unaffected. So there is an unaffected male, an unaffected female, another unaffected female, and another unaffected female. And this is the third generation. And because neither of these have, neither of them have Huntington's disease, there's no way that they can pass it on to their offspring. This affected female mates with an unaffected male, and they have six offspring. They have an affected female, an unaffected male, an affected male, an unaffected female, an unaffected female, and an unaffected male. This offspring does not have any offspring. And this offspring, which is affected, mates with a, an unaffected female, and they have three offspring. They have an affected female, an unaffected female, and an affected male. Now, H, a big H, will represent the Huntington's disease gene. And a little h will represent a normal gene. So this affected male has Huntington's disease, so it will be big H, little h. He mates with an unaffected female, so it will be little h, little h. Their offspring will be little h, little h, because this, this one does not have Huntington's disease. Big H, little h, little h, little h, and big H, little h. This offspring mates with an, another unaffected female, and she is little h, little h. All their offspring will be little h's. Um, this offspring mates with an unaffected male. They have six offspring, and it's going to be big H, little h, little h, little h, big h, little h, little h, little h, little h, little h, and little h, little h. And this offspring mates with an unaffected female. That's little h, little h. They have three offspring. Two of them are going to be big h, little h, because two of them are affected. And one is going to be little h, little h, because it is unaffected. And that is a Huntington's disease pedigree.